Good morning. <clears throat> it is July 20, uh, what is it? July 25th, 2013. I'm sitting out in Oak, New Jersey. Let me, let me give you a little look around so you can see. Anyway, I'm sitting out here in Hope, New Jersey on Thursday, July 25th. It's, it's about 7 a.m. And I feel a deep sense of disappointment in Anthony Weiner. I also wonder about this little sickness he seems to have. And I'm angry at him because I thought he would have made a really good liberal mayor of New York, but he's had it. He's had it. I'm not going to vote for him. My wife's not going to vote for him. If he manages to get into any position, which he probably won't. because he just doesn't have control over his primal urges. It's important to have control over your primal urges. This is something that men spend their lives trying to, uh, to deal with. And not that women don't, but it does seem to be a little bit more something for men, a more pressing uh, requirement. Uh, you know what I mean? I mean, obviously men are more aggressive sexually than women are. But Anthony, Anthony, uh, how are you going to possibly support someone like that? It's like having Al Goldstein for mayor. Uh, you just can't, you just gotta have somebody who's, who has a sense of self-control, has a little bit of self-control. Well, what would this guy do as mayor? He would have, he would be out of control. And then he might do things that would be, who knows what he would do. Give in to financial interests. He, you, he's just like a, a wild card. And even though he's, quote, a liberal, can't do it. Can't vote for Anthony. And I hate to say that because I thought maybe he would uh, redeem himself and come back strong and uh, take charge and uh, all that. But no. No. Anthony has let us all down because he couldn't just stop doing the dumbest thing in the world. I mean, for a person who wants to have a reputation, who wants to be a politician, you... <sighs> He's too dumb to be mayor. He's just too dumb. In his own self-control area, he just doesn't have the brains to do it. Okay, next, Catherine Quinn. Here we come. Kathleen Quinn, is that her name? Kathleen Quinn. She's a worker. She doesn't inspire me with broad concepts and all that kind of stuff. And I wonder how subject she will be to the pressure of financial interests and whether she will really be able to lead the city. I don't know, but it looks like she will be the next mayor unless, unless the guy who runs the uh, Ristides becomes mayor and he's he's a little too uh, he wants to do it, I understand but I don't think he has the the expertise They'll make huge mistakes. So who's going to be the next mayor? Uh, maybe uh, Elliot Spitzer should just run for mayor. Or 
Al Goldstein or what was that guy's name? Look at some porn star to run for mayor. At least be open about it. Oh well. Hey, I, I'm I'm not judging. I am judging, aren't I? But what I mean is, is that is that you can't do you can't be texting your pictures of yourself of your private parts over the internet and number one expect it not to be noticed number two not not expect people to say something uh, the women who you sent them to or anybody to say something I mean it's just crazy it's crazy unless you have nothing to lose and you just want to get nuts then go ahead I mean, there are people who have nothing to lose from all that kind of behavior. I guess all the porn stars, although I don't think their lives are so healthy either, to tell you the truth. I think there's a certain way to, to be healthy and stay alive in this world. And promiscuous sex is not it. Drug abuse, excessive drinking, they're not it either. I mean... And Anthony Weiner's method is not it either. All right, Anthony, you have a good life. F hope you find something to do. And you just keep on texting to your heart's desire. Keep it, just do what you need to do. Because we don't care anymore. So you don't have to stop. All right, that's it. Good morning. It is uh, Tuesday, July 30th. July 30th, 2013. Uh, and it's a cool day in New York. Who said there's any global warming? It's cool today. Wait till August. Anyway, uh, it's nice today, finally. And I'm reading the, um, uh, the paper as I see uh, Anthony Weiner our uh, esteemed mayoral candidate here in New York has slipped to fourth in the polling. Uh, that's just what we that New York needs is, is a mayor whose private parts are can be viewed on the internet. That's that's really the kind of influential person I want as the mayor of our city. Uh, whose indiscretion is constantly on view or unless he just feels that that's what you should know about the mayor you should have that uh, point of view that you anytime you want to view his private parts you can that's what kind of mayor he is i don't think so i just something tell in me says i don't think he, he could possibly get anything done as mayor living under that cloud would you call it I, 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 I mean disgrace well yes I mean uh, for a political person I mean see there's the line uh, does a political person a person who wants to be in politics does he have to uh, be uh, above all that and you know you sort of think yes but then politicians are so indiscriminate in so many ways that that uh, uh, anyway I mean they just do such crazy things take you know big bribes and they they they, they, they give in to influences financial interests so much that that his indiscretions in terms of uh, texting himself all over the internet I mean it's, a, it's meaningful it's very meaningful but what would it mean with him as a politician I you know I don't know now that I think about it I don't know it would I don't think he can get elected that's the thing I don't think there's too many people who would just say I'm not having that guy as my mayor I want the pretense I want the pretense of an honest person, forthright and upstanding, who will take his bribes and do his special interests 
with his pants on. Uh, so that's crazy, isn't it? I mean, I'm starting to slowly wonder what it means if the mayor of New York would be uh, obviously accused of such a, and not even accused, admitting admitting to exposing himself on, on, on the internet. And then what would that mean in terms of his mayorality? Really? Really? What would that mean? Uh, I don't know. I mean, he'd be a, the people would be constantly make references to it. And he could say, yeah, I did that. Okay, fine. Fine. Now here's what we're going to do. I mean, interesting, isn't it? Interesting. I mean, I'm changing my mind. I don't... My first blush is, oh, you can't have a mayor like that. But, I mean, what's the big deal? He's just showing up, showing himself off. Now, all right. Uh... Plus, little boys from time to time show themselves off. Uh, so, I mean, does it mean he's really not mature enough? Well, it was a very bad decision. Very bad decision to do that. And it would have been much easier for him had he not done that. Now that he's in that position and he still wants to run for mayor... Everybody's a moralist. I mean, I, I see in the paper that even Elliot Spitzer criticized him. Uh, and, and that's calling the, the kettle calling the pan black. Is that what it's called? The kettle calling the something black. Anyway, l let me look further into this and I'll, I'll be right back. I'll be right back. Okay, this is uh, Wiener on July 30th continued. Um, I must admit, this morning, I am of a different mind than I was yesterday when, uh, uh, I mean, I still think he's a jerk for doing that, not knowing that you, you're putting your whole career in jeopardy by one simple act. And what I don't like is, 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 is the aggressiveness of it. I mean, sending pictures of yourself, uh, your private parts to women who you don't know who may not want that is very aggressive and I don't know that it's I don't think most women appreciate that very much I think it's just too aggressive I mean I'm being I'm being very uh, understanding it's easy to say, yeah, yeah, the guy should be in jail. Well, he should. I don't know if he, what, what it means in terms of his aggression, his aggressive. Is certainly, I don't know. If thoughtless, well, did the women ask for it? I don't know. I don't know. I mean, it's certainly, and then the fact that he, he lost his congressional seat and still continues to do it. Well. He's going to have himself subject to blackmail if he's the mayor and he does it again because people can blackmail him easily and get what they want. So it's a very complex issue, isn't it? I mean, the fact that the world would know that this mayor has exposed himself on the Internet. I don't know. I just can't see... I can't see us electing him knowing that how he has compromised himself. I just can't see it. I can't see it. I mean, I think he's the best, politically the best candidate, but he's a uh, little too, little too liberal. Just a little too liberal. Okay.